Hello, it's only editing me. Hello. So it's been a wee while now. It's been 17 days since I actually marched from the Disney Magic, and it's high time I put together day three and disembarkation day. We did three nights um, on the Disney Magic, you know, coming from Liverpool to Liverpool, and it was fabulous. And if you haven't seen the other videos, why not? Come on, people, catch up, catch up. So I had. Um, I had a, the most fantastic time, but in this particular video, which I'm going to keep short because I'm actually not accidentally vlogging halfway through this video, I remember that I'm vlogging and I actually do some camera time. So um, in this you'll see us take breakfast in Lumiere's. You might notice that Jenny and Alex are bounding again. So Alex is Peter Pan this time and Jennifer is Evil Queen. Um, and halfway through the day she also changes her wig to natural hair colour wig and um, she is also doing some anime cosplay at the same time and she was recognised by one of the servers in Lumiere and it made her day, oh my gosh it made her day. So um, yeah we do some time by the pool, there's some screenshots from the navigator app. Now if you join the Facebook group Disney Loads of people have done snapshots and scrolls of the menus and it's a really, really good place to be if you're lucky enough to have those Southampton or Newcastle um, ones. Oh my God, I'm so jealous. I wish I was coming with you. I really do, but my bank balance will stretch that far. <laughs> and until I get a thousand subscribers, I'm not monetized. Well, at least you can watch this without adverts, which is good. I'm hoping as well that you'll appreciate some of the uh, some of the little quirks that went on in my filming. I'm not quite sure why I've got so many pictures of carpets, but I found it amazing that the carpets on each floor of the atrium represent different floor, different levels of the sea. Um, and there was also the world carpet outside our room and then we even argued over the carpet in Dealer. Is it sneaky bb or is it hidden wickets? We're not quite sure. Um, there's some footage from Sarge Says and the Family Time Game Show. Absolutely fantastic. We saw some great characters as well, which we love doing. And then we all got ourselves changed and looking posh for Lumiere. And we had the most fantastic meal before. We had a little bit of a walk around on the deck and we disembarked and some disembarkation uh, chit chat there as well. And oh my gosh, there's not a lot of vlogging from the last day. I can't make a whole video about the last day and I can't make a whole video about the last day because I was in tears, absolute tears. And so was Jen, bless her. We were both very upset that we had to leave. Um, a three night stay is not enough. I believe that some people have gone back to back. I mean, I think they are. They've obviously got loads of money, loads of taste, and loads of great sense. Because if I could have done it, I would. But literally, this was this was squeezed into uh, this was squeezed into um, my husband's working week. He did nights, then went on to the Disney Magic, and then went back to work the next day. So I, I took home leave. Um, we are actually meant to be going to Disney World. Maybe you want to know how much the cruise was. Maybe you want to know what we ate, what we drank. Um, just leave a comment below and I'll try and help out with your answers. Thank you so much for your comments on my other videos. And I'm absolutely loving this. I've got one more video to do and I'm going to do about all about the food that we had and that we saw and that we, we put weight on with, which I've actually spent two weeks and here's a sneaky way in for lost the five pounds that I bought. So yay! <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's it. 
that's it. You know, like, subscribe, and I'll see you. So here we are, it's day three, our last full day. I've got my blanket on my legs. Um, you can see over there, there's some towels and blankets they're kept in those cupboards. The crew members will give you them and I'm just gonna give you a quick look at the pool. There's some funnel vision and then I'm gonna turn it round. Might have to do a voice over this because it'll be all trademarked, but never mind. All right, switch you soon, bye. So that there, underneath that top, is a hot tub. And then I think in that funnel, can't remember what's in there, but I think that's concierge. And then there's another hot tub. Then there's this pool here, which goes up to about my waist. Uh, it's 1.2 meters, four, four foot deep. So it's got loads of lifeguards around it, so like a puddle. Then it's the movies, that's called Funnel Vision. Underneath it is the... I don't know something but behind there is cabanas and then there's cove which is the adults one with the adults pool and then that is the one of the water slides and i know vibe is in there somewhere my kids haven't been bothered but never mind and then you can promenade all the way around the deck so this isn't the top deck the top deck's up there that's deck 10 and then they have world of sports up there which we've seen once but didn't go to that's pinocchio's and that's the shawarma place on the edge of pinocchio's right there on the left hand side and i swear to you that will be why i put on weight today's way day but there's no scales here so that's fantastic we like that and the way that they're queuing around the pool so the queues are 15 minutes in the hot tub one pound in each and then everybody can kind of get in the pool when it gets to maximum which i think is 15 people they kind of change them out every 15 minutes but it's all right it's waiting for the kids and the hubby to come back i've got some coffee some more sorted Good. 
Uh, this is going to be a great army song for two and a half years. We're going to get the toys in tip-top shape. We're looking sharp, boys. But I think it's time to pick up the bass. The hard says, double time. Trying not to. 
uh, drop my phone over the empty down there, don't think I'd get it back. So I was waiting for enough um, enough time to get us into our Mersey port. I can't really pick out much in this skyline. Um, we're gonna book at um, we're gonna be off at 9.30. We've got breakfast at 8.40. Our bags won't last night. And I think I'm just too sad. Really, three days is not long enough. When you think about it, it's not long enough to think, oh, I wanna be at home. Had a good time, but not slept very well last night. I think it was the lack of rocking, because I think we were in the river a lot of the night. Uh, yeah, it's probably a good job. I forgot to give everyone their travel tablets last night, so could have some sickness this morning, I'm guessing. But they're all right, these babes. They're all right. Lumiere's was amazing. Uh, best go back in. I'll show you what's left of our room now. Like I said, the main bags went last, last night, so we just got our luggage this morning. Two tired children that will be sleeping on the right hand side. Telly going. American plugs, charger, two USBs here, so what's the left of our bed, telly's on, you can get a prize if you know what that movie is, really old one, then you know it's eventually the alarm clock, so what's the USBs, two there, so you've got four, four USBs, not three, four, four USBs, extremely comfy bed. So, customer service that we filled in. These are our tips for this morning. So, I've got a thank you card for Jerry Lee, who's our um, steward. Really nice guy. Leaving the tea bags left in the fridge. And then we've just got morning clothes. You can see plenty of hangers. Let me jump her up there. Plenty, plenty of space there. I can't believe how much space there is in here. And the famous H2O products. If I wash my hands a billion times, I might smell of it for at least a day. And then, um, yeah, perfectly full bathroom. See you, morning. Morning. Mm, look at Mickey towels. So. Right, so, as you can see, that's me done now. We're all going to go, it's just disembarkation, so if you see any more, then it's just like a bit of a mismatch of what goes on this morning. Got to get the kids up, get them in the shower. Okay, hear background noise, that's because Andy's in the shower. Um, I've had I've had a fantastic time, I think I've put a whole dress out on. I feel very, uh, feel very bloated. You can blame Lumiere's, I think I had about seven courses last night, because you can have what you want, so I kept asking for one. I know, I know, that's absolutely nuts, but we got to bed at midnight again last night, so we've definitely packed it in, you know, I think one night we made it to bed before midnight, but only just, um, it's been absolutely amazing, I've not got anything, I've not got everything done I wanted to get done, because there just isn't enough time in, in three days, so that's me done on a slightly uh, depressed note. But I have checked my emails this morning, and I've got my uh, I've got my photo pass refund coming, and um, so I've got to go and do photos now. So I'm going to go and do that. Go to shutters and we get a USB or something. And um, so hopefully they'll be peppered in, or if you go onto Instagram or Facebook or whatever, you'll find them. Um, I've I've had a fantastic time. It's been absolutely a star. The crew are phenomenal. I can't honestly, if it was any cleaner, it would be my own my bum for me. Just crazy how clean this place is. And I'm going to get home and I think I'm going to have to scrub the place from top to bottom. I'm going to go and go do that. So this will be my outro. See you later. Thanks very much. Consider like subscribing.
this embarkation day, isn't it? Once inside the terminal building, you may be required to provide a proof of citizenship for the inspection by Customs and Border Protection. Please do not forget to drop off your public cards in boxes provided next to the gangway and out.